Welcome back to my channel. This video is about Halema Mutlante and Jacob Zuma. You know, these two once fell out over Jacob Zuma taking over before Halema Mutlante. For continue, please do me a favor. Do not forget to subscribe for more latest updates. So, a lot of people have been asking Guti, how does Halema Mutlante actually feel about Jacob Zuma joining MK Party? You know, at this point, it's difficult to answer that question, but what I'll say is that you guys remember when Khalima Mutlante used to comment on Jacob Zuma and say that Jacob Zuma is a true and honest leader, you know. I'm talking about the incident that happened over more than 10 years ago. That time he used to say that Jacob Zuma is honest and he has known Jacob Zuma for over 30 years, you know. He was saying this because at that particular, at that particular time Jacob Zuma was not yet a president. So Khalima Mutlante felt like he was going to become a president, official president before Jacob Zuma. Now, Jacob Zuma later surprised Khalema Mutlante when he became a president. Now, that's when Khalema Mutlante and Jacob Zuma started, started having fallouts. You know, Khalema Mutlante, I feel like he was jealous that Jacob Zuma became a president before him, you know. And you guys know that Khalema Mutlante, like Thabo Mbeki, are true revolutionists. You guys know that these two never really got along with Jacob Zuma. You guys know that Jacob Zuma is completely different between, you know, Khalima Mutlante and Thabo Mbeki because those two are actually revolutionaries. They are, they, are, they are like, we hate corruption. We are against corruption, you know. It's one of the top leaders that have never entertained corruption really that much. Obviously, Khalima Mutlante with, ANC, with Jacob Zuma leaving ANC like that, he will have a serious problem because these people are truly committed members of ANC. I'm not saying that Jacob Zuma is wrong for going for MK party. It's what he believes that you know is better for this whole country and he believes that it's a good move for him. But I don't think that Khalima Mutlanta would actually you know appreciate Jacob Zuma living like that because he once had fallout with Zuma because Jacob Zuma became bigger than him. Even this particular time, Jacob Zuma is taking, you know, bigger moves than Khalima Mutlante. So it actually makes sense that Khalima Mutlante and Tabon Beki don't like uh, Jacob Zuma because, you know, they feel like Jacob Zuma sometimes, you know, is arrogant and tries to be over over everyone. You so know. you guys share your thoughts on the comment section below about what you think and do not forget to subscribe for more latest updates.